The VT5, known domestically as the TAF-15 or ZTQ-15, is a light tank developed by China North Industry Corporation, Norinco, as a third-generation vehicle tailored for export market. The VT5 offers a unique mix of mobility, firepower, and adaptable angle, positioning it as a powerful tool for countries requiring a versatile light tank in challenging terrains like mountainous areas. Norinco first unveiled the VT5 at Air Show China in November 2016, and it has since gained attention for its capabilities in regions where heavy main battle tanks may struggle due to the weight and lack of agility. The VT5 was designed with a similar layout to main battle tanks, featuring a three-person crew, the driver, who is positioned at the center of fan hall, the gunner and the commander seated within the turret. Its design distinguishes it from the ZTQ-15, which serves in the Chinese People's Liberation Army. Notable differences include the VT5 center placement of the driver's hatch and the curved upper front hull, compared to the straight hull and left aligned driver's hatch in the ZTQ-15. The VT5 also has modular ammo kits tailored for the export market, offering flexibility in ammo levels from base-like configurations up to explosive reactive ammo and composite options. Weighing between 33 to 36 tons, the VT5 light tank achieves superior maneuverability through a 1000 horsepower diesel engine, providing a power to weight ratio of up to 30 horsepower per ton, depending on the ammo configuration. This allows it to reach road speeds of 70 km per hour and 35 to 40 km off-road with a maximum range of 450 km. The hydromechanical automatic transmission and pivot steering further enhance the tank's agility, making it suitable for trains such as mountainous regions and narrow battlefields, where heavy tanks are less feasible. The VT-5 primary weapon is a 105mm rifle gun with a thermal sleeve and film extractor, capable of firing armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding sabot, high-explosive anti-tank and high-explosive rounds, as well as a gun-lodged anti-tank guided missile. With a firing range of up to 3000m for a direct fire and 5000m for missiles, the VT-5 can effectively engage a range of targets, including heavy ammo vehicles. The tank is equipped with an automatic loading system, which increases firing speed and reduces the need for an additional loader, while the empty cartridge cases are ejected through a rear turret hatch. Secondary armaments include a 12.7mm machine gun and a 14mm automatic rallied launcher mounted on a remote operation weapon station, enhancing versatility against infantry and live vehicles. The Bangladesh specific VT 5BD variant, however, replaced the remote control 12.7mm machine gun with the manually operated one. The turret has a full stabilization system, improving accuracy while in motion. The VT5 standard protection includes welded steel armor, with modular add-ons available for advanced composite and era layers. Sled armor can also be installed around the turret and house size, protecting against rocket propelled grenades and anti-tank missiles. Bangladesh VT5 BD variant includes the GL5 active protection system, which intercepts incoming projectiles, improving survivability in complex combat environments. 
Additionally, the VT5 is outfitted with smoke relay destructors on either side of the turret and laser detection systems to counter any tank threats. It should have standard equipment includes chemical, biological, radiological and nuclear protection, air conditioning, and advanced navigation systems with initial navigation system and satellite communication capabilities. The tank's digital fire control system, panoramic sight, and laser range fighter ensure high situation awareness and effective battlefield command and control capabilities. The VT-5 has seen active adoption, most notably by Bangladesh, which procured 44 units in 2019. As the VT-5BD variant, Bangladesh displays its VT-5 tanks for the first time during the Victory Day military parade on December 16, 2022, underscoring its commitment to modernizing its armor forces with high mobility and technologically advanced tanks. The Bangladesh Army chose the VT-5 for its adaptability to a variety of landscapes, a crucial feature in regions with mixed terrain types. China's domestic counterpart, the Type 15 or ZTQ-15, is currently deployed in the PLA's Xinjiang Military Command and among the Chinese Marines. These regions require the mobility and adaptability of light tanks like the ZTQ-15, demonstrating its strategic importance in China's military strategy for operations in mountainous and coastal environments. The ZTQ-15 debuted publicly during China's 70th anniversary military bread rehearsal in 2019 symbolizing its role in the PLA's modernization efforts. The VT-5's adaptability and advanced technology position it as a strong competitor in the light tank market, particularly for countries needing versatile ammo in restrictive environments. Its ability to operate effectively on challenging terrain like mountainous and jungle areas makes it an ideal choice for countries across Asia, Africa, and potentially Latin America. The modular armor and compatibility with modern combat systems further enable the VT-5 to suit various operational needs and budget constraints. In modern joy operations, the VT-5 offers strong information capabilities ensuring that it can seamlessly integrate into network warfare environments.